Hello guys, this is the unboxing video of the MSI 870G45 mainboard. Um, this mainboard comes with a 3 years warranty. It has um, solid capacitors, which means it's going to be 10 years lifetime. Um, it has OC Genie, which is a auto overclocking system for EC overclocking. It has unlock CPU core, stable unlock, and mainly this is the first. Um, this is the main reason why I bought this because I bought a Semprom processor, which I wanna unlock the second core hopefully. And well, let's take a look at what's inside. Okay, well, let's read this. It is um, socket AM3. Um, it has four DDR3 um, slots for the RAM. It has um, gigabit LAN, uh, SATA power cable, have one, SATA cable one, and have um, some E IDE cable for old um, parallel ATA um, hard drives so right here we can see we have the SATA cable power cable to SATA to Molex if you don't have a power supply that doesn't have um, SATA power and it has a SATA cable and the IDE cable for the um, older hard drives or CD-ROMs or whatever. It has a bracket. It has drivers and utility. Um, MSI Fusion, what is this? It's like a quick install guide or some sort. Yeah. Yeah, memory, storage devices, graphic cards, front panel. Yeah, it's like a quick start guide. Operating system, system and utilities. Quick, oh yeah. Quick installation guide. Okay. We have the user guide which has more details on the motherboard let's look at the specification it says here that supports AMD Phenom 2 um, X4 and X3 Athlons X4, X3 and X2 processor in the AM3 package hyper transport 3.0 supports 5.2 um, it has Northbridge is the AMD RX 780 chipset and the Southbridge is the AMD SB 710 chipset memory support DDR3 uh, 1600 with overclocking uh, you can put a total of 16 gigabytes of RAM it has four dims, um, 240 pin at 1.5 volts. It supports uh, gigabit LAN audio. It has integrated audio by BIA with the chipset BT1820S. Flexible H channel audio with jack sensing. And one IDE which supports Ultra DMA. 66, um, 100 and 133 mode, and it has six SATA ports. Which, by the way, those are SATA. You can connect SATA 1 or SATA 2, which are three gigabits per second, and you can make a rate from 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 the the whole six ports. You can make rate 0, 1, 10 or 
JBOD mode by AMD SB710 that's the south bridge okay it has floppy port it has um, one PS2 keyboard PS2 mouse one serial port 6 USB 2.0 one LAN port 6, flex six flexible audio ports on board 3 USB 0.2 connectors for the cases for external I think one S PDF out connector one front panel audio connector one chassis instruction intru intrusion connector for those people that um, have those things on the case one CD in connector and an easy overclock switch it has one PCI Express port slot I'm sorry which is X16 and it has three PCI slots and this is ATX form factor is 21.0 centimeters by 30.5 centimeters it has six mounting holes okay well the bad thing about this is that it doesn't have USB 3.0 but I really don't care about that because I wanted uh, to build a cheap system and I really don't care about USB 3.0 right now maybe later I can put a PCI um, card if I want to use that in the future okay let's open this thing up let's see the board itself okay here's a board it's pretty nice black color okay it says military class top quality components um, auto overclocking OCG and I guess this is our north bridge chipset and this is our south bridge chipset and as you can see this have a serial port and those PS2 connectors for keyboard and mouse LAN 6 USB 2.0 and audio channels and that's pretty much it it has right here the IDE connector and two SATAs and okay one two three four five six SATA ports well that's it guys I hope you enjoy it and if you have any question um, you can put it in the comment area thank you very much goodbye